obviously, you know, Nipsey Hustle, we know we heard the news, it resonated all throughout, you know, Twitter land and Facebooks and um, just around the world, you know, he was he was shot, fatally shot six times. I think it was five to the body, one to the head. It's just really crazy, man. I just wanted to come in and give my condolences for a lot, a lot of you guys that are fans of Nipsey. Uh, you know, I never actually got a chance to get to his music on this channel, but I've definitely heard my fair share of Nipsey along with Dom Kennedy. So I just kind of felt that, man. You know, they said he was with his daughter as well at, at his own shop in L.A., I think that's crazy, man, to shoot a man in cold blood while he's with his kids, especially someone that was doing a lot of a lot of things for the community. You know, he was trying to, you know, help his people. He was just trying to better himself. Just got nominated for a Grammy last year in 2018 and, you know, having finally having all this success come to him and, you know, his life just taken early at 33. It just it's just mind blowing to me, man. Like it just when I have a lot of faith in this world and I think this world is a better place and I kind of just move in this like I, I move, like I, I move in silence, man. So I kind of just look at it. And I, I see the good in, in a lot of people, and in, in many people actually. I know there's some sickos out there, and definitely some crazy people out there. I feel like, you know, he, you know, I feel like it's just, you know, life. Don't take life for granted. At any time, it could be taken away from you. Um, you could be having going everything going for you, having all the money in the world, having all your assets having a perfect family, a lovely wife, and the next thing you know, someone just wants to kill you because, you know, the hate in their, and the hate in their heart. I just don't really understand that hate, you know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of people were saying it's probably, you know, some bad blood. I know a lot of people are, are coming up with the theories that, you know, it was the government. You know, people are trying to find anything for answers because that's, you know, the answers is what's going to get you through um, to, to help you understand. I feel like a lot of the LBGT community and, and like... For whatever Nipsey did in the past to y'all, I know you know he's had a lot of questionable things, but that should not be. No one should ever wish death upon someone quickly. Five minutes after he died, and everybody's like, "I'm glad he died." You know, a lot of the Ariana Grande stands were coming at him. A lot of like the transgender LBGT community was coming at him. That's the thing that right there, where like it's just it's not even about at this point. It's just about being a human. You know what I'm saying? Someone just lost their life, and you're already trying to go at someone's throat. I think that's literally the inhumane thing to do. I am ashamed, and that's why a lot of people really don't like Ariana Grande. Not because Ariana Grande is not talented, because I love Ariana Grande. It's because her fans are just sick in the head and, and ridiculous, man. I just, I, I don't understand. No matter what, death is death. It's a strong thing. And if it happened to any of one of y'all families, y'all would be in the same boat. And a lot of you would want somebody to come, you know, console you. Imagine if you lost somebody in your, in your family, and how would you handle it? You'd probably kill yourself. And then, you know, you understand why there's so much suicide rate because so many internet bullies and, you know, there's people not strong enough to fend for themselves. I, that's just a whole nother topic, man. But Nipsey Hussle, man, just when he was, everything was going for him, they just take his life away. I really don't really get it, man. It's just like, I don't know. I mean, what can you really do? All right. Like a lot of people are saying, you know, I, I don't. Gang, for someone to be so much respected, especially around that, you know, the L.A. community, you know, him letting it known that, you know, he used to bang and, you know, he reps hard. It's just like, who would shoot him in broad daylight at his store? That's crazy, right? And now it's it's really about to get dangerous, man, because I see it all around the news. They're starting to start riots all in L.A. They're starting to go crazy. I hope it doesn't spark something like that because... Right now, I feel like just the music community just needs to come together. Um, you know, after having one of his best works, you know, in terms of um, Victory Lap, I feel like, you know, he had some more shit coming. He finally got the buzz. And a lot of great artists came out, it's like the J. Coles and, you know, the Meek Mills. You know, that could have been some 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 combos that they could have did some features in the, in the near future. But we will never, ever get that. But uh, like Kanye always said, man. The people never get the flowers why they can still smell them. You know, that, that was one of the, the best lines from graduation, Big Brother. And I feel like that's that's true, man. As soon as someone passes by, that's when everybody comes out. So uh, today, man, just give your loved ones a hug. You know, keep your head up for if y'all hurting out there. I know a lot of y'all still going through the deaths that we had in the last two years. Hip-hop has had a lot of deaths in the last two years. It's really crazy. And, you know, like I said, a lot of people deal with and cope with death differently. Um... You know, me, myself, you know, I, I just, I listened to a song, you know, paid a little tribute to him, took a little, took a little drink and then, you know, I got to keep moving, man. We got to keep living. So 
If y'all need anything, man, get in the comments below. Let me know what y'all favorite. Just let me know what y'all favorite track was from Nipsey Hustle in the comment box below. And that's that's the way you're gonna pay respects on my channel from him. So we're gonna keep it like that, man. Hey, bless up. Love y'all. Thank y'all for supporting, man. And keep y'all head up. We out.